Another contentious public meeting tonight in Central Oregon. Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. A Deschutes County hearings officer took testimony tonight about a request for a change in farmland. A developer wants to build homes on about 700 acres of farm zoned land west of Terrebonne. Our Kelsey McGee listened in on the meeting tonight. Kelsey? Lee, the land has the potential to be rezoned from farmland to rural housing. The group wanting the change is 710 Properties LLC. At the meeting, there were many in opposition. The property is about two miles north of Highway 126. It's surrounded by farmland, federal land, and some subdivisions. The applicants say while it's zoned exclusively for farm use, it's not agricultural land due to its poor soil. The land has lava rock present along the west and northwest edges. The subject property does not have water rights and is not currently being farmed. A representative for the applicants says they're not in it for the money. The project is really not about maximizing profits. If we were trying to maximize profits, we would be doing things quite differently. First, we'd be pursuing higher housing density than the rural residential 10-acre zoning that we're currently applying for. What really is affordable housing nowadays? Comments by the developer of, about affordable homes. Uh, I don't see uh, that the, any homes with 10-acre um, uh, parcels in that area would be, in fact, affordable. This neighbor says he's seen many dead animals on the road due to cars speeding on the winding roads. He's terrified of more traffic and its impact. Say there eventually were 70 homes. That's 140 potential cars traveling each day. If I have these concerns and fears already based on what's existing, I don't even want to know what's going to happen. The applicant submitted a traffic impact analysis and claimed the area's roads can handle increased traffic. The applicant's attorney says there's no wildlife zone on the property. Lee, back to you.